Hi, I'm Rosa. You might see me around the school or the cafeteria. Today I will I will be reading The Social Butterfly by Beth Bracken, illustrated by Sofia Cardoso. Charlotte loved being with her friends. She loved playing dogs with Lily, dress up with Etta, house with Ben, and trucks with Max. And Charlotte was quite good at making new friends too. She made friends at the store, at the library, and at school. Charlotte loved school. She loved learning and she loved being with her friends, but sometimes she tried to do both at the same time. During morning meeting, she kind of listened to Miss Flora, but she mostly whispered with her friends. At reading time, Charlotte finished her book. She wanted to talk with Etta, but when she was talking, Etta couldn't read. Then it was math time. Charlotte was one of the first to finish the worksheet. She wanted to sing with Max, but when she was singing, Max couldn't focus on adding. And when it was lunchtime, Charlotte was so busy talking and laughing with Lily and Ben that none of them had time to eat. That meant all three of them were really hungry after recess. The next day was show and share, but Charlotte didn't know that. She hadn't been paying attention during morning meeting the day before. She didn't have anything to share, and neither did Etta because they'd been talking instead of listening. When Charlotte finished her book at reading time, she started talking to Etta. Charlotte, Etta cried, I can't read when you're talking. After Charlotte finished the day's math worksheet, she started to tell Max a joke. Charlotte, Max said, I can't count when you're talking. At lunchtime, Charlotte sat between Etta and Ben. Before she could even open her mouth, Ben said, My mom says I shouldn't talk at lunch anymore. I was so hungry yesterday that I was kind of a handful. During recess, Charlotte talked to Miss Flora. My friends don't like me today, Charlotte said. That's not true, Miss Flora said. Your friends like you. Then why? Why? Don't they want to talk to me? Charlotte asked. What's your favorite thing about school? Miss Flora asked Charlotte. That's easy, reading and math and being with my friends, Charlotte said. Your friends like those things too, Miss Flora said. But when someone's talking to them, they can't learn. I think I got it, Charlotte said. The next day, Charlotte sat behind Lily during morning meeting, but, di but she didn't talk. Charlotte sat still and listened. She sat next to Etta during reading time. Charlotte sat still and listened. Charlotte sat next to Lily during math. She waited until Lily finished her worksheet before she told her a joke. She ate lunch next to Ben. They talked a little, but they finished all their food. And when it was time to go outside, Charlotte was ready to run, talk, sing, and play. And so were her friends. The end.